And we have new information tonight about how and why a 28 year old woman allegedly posed as a teenager to enroll at Hanville High School. The St. Charles Parish Sheriff's Office spelled out the details just a couple of hours ago. WGNO's Jordan Lippincott is at the Sheriff's Office tonight. Jordan. Kurt, Susie, 46 year old Marta Serrano Alvarado and her daughter, 28 year old Martha Gutierrez Serrano are out of jail this evening following their arrest yesterday. Both women are facing a public records injuring charge. Uh, we've gotten a lot of concerns. Obviously, this is somewhat unusual situation. Uh, I've always said nothing, you know, you know, I've seen everything. Well, pretty much, you know, we haven't seen everything. St. Charles Parish Sheriff Greg Champagne says his office was alerted by the parish's school system last month that they had received a tip about a woman in her 20s posing as a 17 year old Hanville High student. School officials then launched an internal investigation. The student had been at Hanville High School, I believe, since the beginning of uh, last school year. And we, in fact, verified that the birth certificate uh, was not legitimate, that it was falsified, uh, made to look like this young lady, you know, 28 years old, was in fact 28 years old and she was not 17. Officials say with the assistance of her mother, 46 year old Marta Serrano Alvarado, 28 year old Martha Gutierrez Serrano was enrolled as a freshman at the school in the fall of 2022, where she completed the year. Champagne says many have asked him if anything nefarious went on. Well, the answer to that is based upon everything that we know, uh, the answer is no. Uh, she was in school. She minded her own business. She did her schoolwork. She caused no trouble. She was not a disciplinary problem. Uh, she violated no laws in the community that we had to deal with her. As far as we know, she did nothing inappropriate at all, merely attended school. School Superintendent Dr. Ken Ortling says because of this incident, they're now conducting a full review and he's urging other Louisiana school systems to do the same. As a result of this discovery, we are conducting an audit of enrollment documents for students currently enrolled in St. Charles Parish Public Schools. We are reviewing student enrollment policy and procedures, and we will make enhancements based upon that review. Officials say the daughter's motive was to learn English and that she was here illegally after immigrating from Honduras in 2021. Susie Kurt. If Sheriff Champagne says this is a new one on him, it's a new and one for everyone. Everybody.